everyone let's talk about basil today <laughs> and how to get such amazing constantly giving basil you might have already watched other videos in these pots I do have combined tomato plants with basil and they actually perfectly complement each other they do go very well together and I'm gonna show you in these pots, I just have basil, nothing else. And they're growing beautifully. Okay, what you have to do, it's very easy and very simple. To have constantly growing basil, you just need to be cutting the, the tops and the big leaves that you have here. This will actually make your plant focus on this um, smaller growth here. I'll try to focus the camera. You see? Underneath your, uh, your top and next to these leaves. Right now this plant is focused on uh, making even bigger this top and these side leaves. But if I take them off, it will focus on the small ones here. And it will make even more growth because I take off one top and I get two new ones. I'm going to show you here where I have already taken the top. And this is a growth of such a tiny little thing. It became as big as this. Okay. This is easy, right? You can do that. What else you need to grow good basil is abundance of water it really does like water and you need to have soil which is very well drained so you can have some perlite inside or some sand like this one here this will make your soil soil <laughs> uh, very um, good for the roots of the basil because the roots they need to go you see i have them in plastic bottles if you saw my uh, other video how to make pots out of plastic bottles you saw how easy that is so it it needs good soil so that the roots can move freely you see you can see part of the roots already here because the soil is very good this soil that they are in is actually a combination of whatever soil we have here um, also some nice compost compost um, that's the other rule <laughs> uh, that basil loves it loves really um, good compost so it can get these beautiful green leaves and it also has some sand and some coconut coir and this this soil is amazing it's just the perfect combination so like I said, the next thing you want to do is to make sure you water them on a regular basis and you give them a good compost. So you can add good compost to the soil from the moment you're planting them. And uh, well, what you need to do is just add from time to time maybe some liquid um, organic fertilizer or something that you have made you can make fertilizer your own it's very easy just to ferment um, some the leaves of some plants like dock for example people don't talk much about dock <laughs> how you can make an amazing fertilizer fertilizer out of dock but nettles dock mm, except everything else that you have met so far. That's what I have in the garden, that's what I make my fertilizer from. And this is pretty much it guys, it's very easy to grow basil. You just need to chop off the things, the heads, from time to time, and keep some growing, and just keep on watering every day. When it's very hot, I water them two times a day, in the morning and in the evening after sunset because I have my basil outside and it gets uh, hit by the sun in some of the hottest times and I cannot describe you 
the amazing smell it has. It's excellent to make pesto, just to throw like this in salad, especially combined with tomatoes, like I showed you in the other plant, in the other pots. They combine very, very well with tomatoes. They actually help each other and basil makes your tomatoes sweeter. Okay, I hope I helped you with this video and I hope you give it a try. Make sure as well that you have enough space between your plants. In this pot I just have three, you see. It's quite big of a pot. It's bigger than what it looks actually. And I have just three. And all these three are giving me so, so much here. Here I also have just three. And it's giving me also so very much. It's amazing. Happy gardening and we'll see you next time. Make sure you subscribe.